So I had a sensor go out. It's called a TSR sensor. And where that sensor is, right there in the middle of the screen, that black thing way up in there. Let's see if we can get a, a light on here. That's the sensor right there. You gotta take that bolt out and then pull that plug out. Okay, you take that bolt out right there, the bottom of your left corner screen, and that, that holds that whole plug in, okay? But here's the problem. You can barely get your hand in there, as you can see. Yeah. The pain to get to right down there between the air compressor and the front of the uh, water pump area. I mean, power steering pump. I'm sorry, I said water pump. Power steering pump. You get the power steering pump, it's right there. And that's the housing to the whole front of the engine, and the air compressor is there. And here's the problem with this situation is if you fuck around. And those, sometimes you take the bolt out and then you're supposed to pull the plug out, okay? And that wire runs along there, it's a TSR, it's a timing, it goes to the timing, it's a timing reference sensor. Then there's the SRS, which is a synchronizing reference sensor. Uh, sometimes those go out too, but if the synchronizing reference sensor goes out, you won't even be able to start the engine. And I can start my engine. The timing reference sensor, it tell it, it, it runs like it's missing real bad like real bad though like it'll cut out like the time is off so i was able to get pulled over here in this abandoned mall outside of charlotte north carolina and they may not be able to get me in the shop till monday but yesterday i was sitting on the side of the road in the middle of nowhere so hey you know whatever i'll take what i can get i'll just be cool could go get me a motel but why waste the money? I mean, my generator's working. I'll just sit my ass here tomorrow. I know there's some Mexican cats that I know up the road here. I might be able to get to go get the sensor and hook me up. And if not, then I'm going to be stuck here until Monday. I should have been on my way back to Topeka, Kansas today. But uh, I didn't even be able to even go get the load. But the good thing about these Detroit 60 series motors is they're not really too complicated. And in this case, with this glider kit, this is a wire, direct wire from point to point. So it's really easy. So, but getting that fucking engine, that plug out, if I took it off, and a lot of people, they, they're stuck in the engine. They're seized in there sometimes. And if you try to pull it out and you fuck up, you break it off in the engine, well, you, they have to take that whole front end off. They had to take this whole front end off to get to it. Yep. 